Welcome to another update for Tribes Ascend. It's a new year. We've been working on a bunch of great new content for you guys, and we've brought in a new dedicated community manager for Tribes. He's been real active in the Tribe scene for years, including organizing tournaments, and he's been a great addition to the studio since our last update. So to tell you about all the new content, here is Hi-Rez APC. Hey everyone, as Todd just mentioned, I am Hi-Rez APC and I'm happy to bring you the next big update for Tribes Ascend. To start off, we'll talk about the six new maps that are coming along with it. Three of them are CTF and three of them are Arena. So let's start talking about them. All right, so Bella Omega. Bella Omega is the first map we'll talk about with the temperatures ranging from 100 to 110 degrees Fahrenheit. Winds from the northwest at 10 to 15 miles an hour. Oh, dude, what are you doing? <laughs> We're not talking about the weather, talk about the maps. <laughs> Oh, right, right. The first map we want to highlight is the return of Bella Omega. Bella Omega was previously in Tribes Ascend, but we're reintroducing it, but with a whole new look. There's two ways to take this flag home. You could take the flag underground through the high-speed horizontal conduits, or you could take the flag through the scorching sun in the high sandy dunes. The choice is yours. Next up is Blue Shift. Blue Shift is located on a large crater on an asteroid with cosmic debris and aerial dogfights up above. You'll notice that there is a rather large base and the flag stand is pretty open, so it's going to take a coordinated offense to get the flag out and a rather tough defense to keep that flag in. The last capture and flag map we'll be adding to this update is called Canyon Crusade Revival. This may look familiar to some old tribes veterans as this is a resurrection of a classic tribes map. There is a canyon in the middle of the map that connects the two flags, so you can take the flag through that way, or you can opt to take the flag over the large hills surrounding the flag stand. This usually leads to some intense flag chasing and some high-speed flag grabs. Along with the new capture and flag maps, we also have three new arena maps, Undercroft, Whiteout, and Freytown. And let us not forget about the two game types, Capture and Flag Blitz and Rabbit. We've added new maps to those as well. Since this is Tribes and we like to be as nostalgic as possible, we're adding the Shocklands to your arsenal. The Shocklands will be made available for every class in the secondary weapon slot. This weapon is only viable at close range and does extra damage if you shock the person in the back, so you better watch yours. We've also added shields to the base turrets and radar sensors. The shields absorb damage and regenerate rather quickly so you need to use the right weapon to take these assets down. That also means the generator has become that much more important since the shields are powered by the generator. On top of all that, we've added two more skins to the game. The first one's for the Juggernaut, and that one's called the Forlorn. Some warriors choose to be mercenaries selling their skill for payment, but the Forlorn join lost causes and let the fame of turning a battle become their payment. And the second skin is for the Doombringer, and that is called the Executioner. With a bullet in his head, he's known to take a hit or two, and he always comes back for more. To see the Executioner means death is upon you. I look forward to seeing you all in-game. If you'd like to play a game or two with me, you can add me to your friends list. My in-game name is HiRezAPC. Thank you for your continued support, and long live tribes. And one other thing, guys. This update marks the first time we have a single purchase option for Tribes. That's right, you can keep playing free to play or you can pay a single price and unlock all the guns, all the classes, all the perks for a single price. This is in response to your requests. It's a pretty big deal. Let's celebrate. <laughs>